Hi guys, so welcome to the Sailor's Lounge. I am currently in Dubai at the Dubai Dry Dock World for dry docking with my vessel and I want to show you what the dry dock, the shipyard looks like. If you're yet to subscribe to the channel, please go ahead and click that subscription icon and also turn on your notifications so you do not miss out on anything. Now guys, join me as I go through the yard, biking my way through the yard to show you what it looks like. Let's go. Now this dry dock is found in Dubai, easily the biggest in the whole of the Middle East. It spans across over 200 hectares of land, has four dry docks, with the largest dock capable of handling the largest ship. That would be Icon of the Sea, yet to be released in 2024. This shipyard handles an estimated 300 projects in a year. That would be an average of 25 projects in a month. Now, this um, project include ship refurbishment, testing, servicing, constructions of um, um, oil rig platforms, and a whole variety of maritime projects and maintenance services. Now, each of the berthing space is fitted with a 50 ton capacity crane for lifting of items onto vessel. Inside this shipyard is also situated the fire station. I have seen a couple of times when the trucks were on display. It was just a drill and nothing serious. It wasn't an emergency. I kept biking my way through the shipyard and you could see they have different workshops for handling different jobs. This is the bigger shop. So I am just going to show you other places. It was fun biking through the shipyard. It was also a bit difficult because I was riding with one hand holding my bike and the other hand holding my camera. That's my phone. I, did, I shot this video with my phone. So they have different vehicles for different activities. This is another shop, a very big workshop. Uh, I can't really identify what the name of the workshop is at the moment, but it was fun watching vehicles go back and forth and a lot of bikers too, like myself. <laughs> This, I think, is the steel shop. Um, I'm not very certain, I'm also more like a tourist. And here, yeah, this is one heavy machine for lifting. I just couldn't resist. I had to stop and make a good video of it. And yeah. So I kept biking my way through the shipyard. You could notice that there are a lot of bicycles in the shipyard. So it is estimated that they have uh, over 10,000 workers, mostly Indians and Filipinos, and they have night shift and day shift. So bicycle is really an essential commodity in this shipyard. I mean, you can't really walk around the shipyard, shipyard that is built on over 200 hectares of land. Bicycle is really very important. Now you need to see when it is launch time. The place is flooded with bicycles. And everybody, I think, is keeping fit because they're always cycling and burning a whole lot of calories, yeah. <laughs> so this scene actually got my attention. I had to stop and make a video of this payload out while it was working. Remember one of the services I mentioned they offer in the shipyard is constructions of oil rig platform. Now this is the platform I was talking about. Really huge.
I think the fun part of my biking through the shipyard is actually biking because it's been a long time I was on the bike and I actually didn't think I would be able to ride a bike again. Uh, not to talk of uh, biking with one hand and making a video with another hand, you know. And people were actually looking at me, I was actually discreet. So this is a closer view of the oil rig platform and I was just going around the entire shipyard. This is their pipe shop, they have a zebra crossing and there will be traffic laws and rules here. Now this is a closer view of the oil rig platform. I was talking about this is how far I could get I had to stop and make this video I kept biking it was fun but it was actually really hot somewhere around 43 degree I think so around this period Dubai is really hot the best time to be in Dubai is somewhere around November to December to January you know that is just a free tip from me So guys, don't forget to subscribe if you're yet to subscribe to the channel. Please go ahead and click that subscription icon and turn on your notifications so you do not miss out on my next video of course they are always exciting new things that you haven't seen before. So at this point I was already coming to the end of my video, biking through um, the shipyard trust me the shipyard is bigger than this i couldn't visit all the places in the shipyard it was fun and yeah these are huge vessels one on the starboard and on the port side and there was a major um welding and fabrication going on on the ship on my port side the red ship the boat red <laughs> but the one on my port side and yeah it was fun to watch and people were still looking at me. What is this boy doing? And I finally got back to my ship. So let me show you a closer view of the 50 ton capacity crane I was talking about. This is the crane constantly walking, lifting items, load onto the vessels and taking off items away from the vessels also. It is really gigantic. Um, this is it. So guys, thank you for watching my video. If you made it this far, um, I need your comments your shares your like subscription turn on your notifications so you do not miss out on anything until next time goodbye from the savers lounge